KSBY's Melissa Newman is live in Santa Maria for us tonight. So Melissa, people can face fines if they don't comply, right? Karina, that's right. People can face a fine up to $1,000 and even jail time. So in order to ensure everyone who needs a mask can get one, the county has set up locations like here off Center Point Parkway where they're giving masks away for free. Santa Barbara County is now raising the stakes in the fight against coronavirus, now requiring more people to wear masks than ever before. Under a new ordinance that goes into effect Tuesday, everyone over the age of 13 must have a face covering while conducting business in public, such as while at the grocery store, pharmacies, and even while riding public transportation. All employees of businesses that interact with the public also have to wear masks. We are just rolling with whatever the guidelines are from the Santa Barbara County Public Health and Environmental Health regulations that they are um, asking us to do. At Piper's Kombucha Brew in Old Town Orchid, they've put up signs to remind customers of the regulations and what they plan to enforce. No, there's not going to be loiter, you know, any kind of like loitering hanging out um, until uh, we're allowed to do that. <laughs> until we are given authorization to resume as business as usual. But not everyone is on board with this new ordinance. They have to wear a mask outside. I don't think it's really necessary, really. So how will local law enforcement handle those who don't comply? The Santa Barbara County Sheriff's Office, the Santa Maria Police Department, and the Lompoc Police Department say they plan on trying to have conversations with people first. We can basically divert getting to the point of enforcement with a lot of different issues just by simply having a conversation, educating the public, and letting them know what the potential problems are, and then um, it, kind of working through the problem or the issue with them. We're hoping that people kind of understand that, you know, nobody wants to wear a mask. Nobody, you know, is super excited about, you know, covering their face, um, but it is, it is a step towards reopening. It is getting us to where we want to be. Now, there are exemptions to the ordinance. The county says those who have medical conditions and can't stay at home are asked to carry a doctor's note if they're concerned about being prevented access to a location. Reporting live in Santa Maria, Melissa Newman, KSBY News. Melissa, thank you. The county says wearing masks while exercising outdoors is only recommended and not required. However, they say it's still best to wear one when social distancing is not possible.